morning everybody it's a little bit chilly here <laughs> a little bit colder than what it was in georgia we got some of our uh, wonderful wonderful snow greeting us this morning not too bad yet i shouldn't complain it's not too bad but it's definitely uh it's definitely just a little bit colder than it was in georgia though but it's good to be home and it's good to be uh in the backyard with the dogs loose. I mean, I know I mentioned it yesterday too, but it's amazing the difference that it makes. Just not having to worry about it. You know, I don't even have to be out here with them. I've just wanted to get out and get some fresh air. It's gonna be a good day today. I'm excited that you're here. I'm excited to be home. We're probably going to go uh, check out our property later on out in the country, but uh, we'll see what happens for now. I'm gonna have a coffee, wake up get ready for the day. I got a question for you. What would you think of me creating some gaming content on this channel? I've recently uh, downloaded the first part of American Truck Simulator. There's a whole bunch of uh, uh, expansion packs that are also available for it. I'm just sort of trying my hand at it now. I had Euro Truck Simulator and I've posted a couple of videos of that that you guys seem to actually really like. I was thinking of maybe making some uh, videos and vlogs of that. Apparently, uh, I've had quite a few people show up in my comment section already requesting that. So I've got the game. I'm getting some equipment for it. I'm getting a little steering wheel for the uh, for the game to make it a lot easier to control the truck in the game. Getting a, a better webcam so that you guys can see me live. So these will be live streams, I think. I'm, I'm planning for them to be live streams. And uh, I got to get a new gaming headset so I can hear what's going on and talk to you guys clearly with noise cancellation. Because right now I'm just using a mic that's very echoey off my computer. I think my computer's right here. And uh, I got American Truck Simulator loaded up right here. So I am newer to the game. Uh, it's, not a, it's not a brand new game, but this game is incredible. It's very realistic. This isn't an ad or anything. I don't want to... I'm not trying to promote them or anything, but uh, they deserve a mention because they did a really good job creating this game. I can have my own business in the game, run my own trucks, and I, I was sort of kind of thinking of uh, going through all of that with you guys on my channel here, and you guys can uh, watch as I build my trucking empire online. For the times when I'm home and stuff, I know you guys like trucking content a lot. That's probably why you clicked on my channel. I am trucker josh by the way i thought maybe you would like some live streaming while i'm playing american truck simulator let me know down below in the comment section what you think of that idea if you don't like it that's totally cool i'll still have my regular vlogs here you don't have to watch the gaming ones but i think a lot of you might uh be interested in that as well let me know so for today anyways uh brit is just getting ready for work she's got to work all day uh, for me, I've got a dentist appointment at 2 o'clock, and then after that, we're going to come pick up the big guys here, Chevy and Diesel. We're going to head down to our land, uh, to our spot outside of town, and check on everything, make sure that the, the trailer is still there and uh, in good shape and not vandalized or broken, and uh, make sure that no mice and stuff has gotten in there, make sure it's all ready for the winter, and just check on things and let the boys run around. That's the plan for today. Then in the evening, we'll come back here and probably watch movies. We, we watched a couple of Christmas movies last night. I wasn't going to tell you. I know we're kind of jumping the gun a little bit here, but we're getting excited. This week, I'm actually hanging up the Christmas lights on the house as well. Not today, but sometime this week. Uh, we're not going to turn them on yet. Don't worry. I'm going to turn them on after Remembrance Day uh, sometime after that. But I, I need to get them up before it starts getting too cold because there's no way I'm hanging up all those Christmas lights when it's minus 50, okay? I mean, you can, you might be able to wait a little longer where it's warmer, and I know you guys have Thanksgiving in the US yet too, 
So you guys might be able to wait till after your Thanksgiving. It's still warm enough to do it then. I can't do that. I can't do it in December here. I will, I'll lose a hand. Literally, I'll freeze my face off. So we're gonna get that done as well. But again, let me know what you think of the, uh, maybe I'll create a separate playlist for it. Just a little bit of extra content on the side on my channel. What do you guys think about it? I'm very curious. The reason I haven't done this before already is because at our old house, we had, we had internet, it was decent internet, but it wasn't good enough for live streaming. My live streams were very choppy. Now at this new house, we have wired internet that comes straight to the house fiber optics. It's 500 megabits per second upload and download, or download and upload, whichever way you want to say that. It's very impressive. I, I can upload a full 25 minute vlog here for you guys in like three minutes. And that used to take four, five, six hours before at our old house. So my live streaming capabilities are a lot better here. So I was kind of thinking, how can I make use of this? I would love to interact with you guys more and do some more live streams, but I don't want to just do live streams where I'm talking all the time. And I figure if I like it so much, and if I'm having fun, why don't I share it with you? You know, I'm, I'm gonna start building up a trucking empire on here. If you're into that, hey, you can come follow along with me. I'm gonna try to keep it interesting and humorous and funny. Try to keep, uh, keep that line of my vlogs going and maybe you guys will like it. You know, if not, maybe I'll attract a whole different audience for those videos, but I'm going to keep doing these videos here for you guys that like these vlogs. So, maybe we can do both. Maybe, eh? I'm really excited about it. I think you guys are really going to like it. I'm going to enjoy making it. So, if it's just extra content on the side of what I'm already doing, hey, nothing's going to change for you guys if you don't like that stuff. But I, I'm excited about it. I'm excited to share that with you, so... Let's see what happens. Maybe this week yet. Maybe this week we'll start that. I'll probably do a live stream later today and explain it to you guys there. See what you guys think. I think it's gonna be fun. So remember yesterday I was telling you that Manitoba went into code red. We're in critical code red now. Critical code red? Yeah, which means I don't get to go to work as of two days from now. Well, that's the word on the street. That's the all the uh, news reports are saying right now. I haven't heard anything from my boss, but I'm just informing them now because I bet you most of them are still sleeping. <laughs> so, in two days, she's going to be without work again. And Manitoba's going into full lockdown. Full critical lockdown. Uh, this might be more intense than the first one. Well, they'll probably be a lot more strict. I know um, as of yesterday, no, pardon me, as of Saturday, they were handing out fines at Superstore. So many people weren't doing the whole mask thing, even though they've had signs up forever. Yeah, since we went through Canadian Tire that one time and we uh, didn't have to wear masks in Canadian Tire, they've put a mandatory, they've slapped us down with mandatory mask wearing now and they've been handing out fines. And the fines I think are pretty big. They go up to what, $1,200? They're $1,200 per person, 5,000 per fine per business. So if you go into a store here in town without a mask and they catch you, $1,200 fine. That should start some comments. Hold my comment section is gonna be lit up. <laughs> what do you guys think of that? What do you guys think of that? I, my opinion on it would be, wow. That's all I have to say. I mean, I understand, I understand. I don't wanna say, I'm not a doctor, right? I don't really know what's going on. I have my opinions, but I'm not a doctor. But wow, that's all I have to say. Yeah, I mean, as someone with a respiratory issue and I can't wear masks, it sucks. Cause like, there's no card or anything that anybody can use or wear to prove that I have a medical condition. I do have a doctor's note for work, but what I wear is, and just watch, they'll ban these too because they ban everything, but I wear these. So it's like a face shield and I can breathe perfectly through it. They're called mingle masks online. I didn't get mine online. Apparently, uh, my coworker's sister works at a, sh at a store called Turnco. I don't know what the heck that is, but these were 25 bucks for 10. And I can breathe perfectly, and I see all my saliva being caught on there. It's disgusting, but I just wash them with dish soap every day. Yeah. You're a moist speaker. I am a moist speaker. You speak I'm, very moistly. I'm a mouth breather. But I just wash these with dish soap every day, and then I hang them to dry, so. Yeah. Mingle masks? Mingle masks. Mingle That's masks. what the ladies at the salon in the mall told me they're called. I didn't order mine online though, so don't quote me. Okay. But I see a lot of people wearing them. And it's nice because I get to show off my expensive teeth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She had uh, braces when she was younger. 
but uh, yeah, she does have perfect teeth. She's a great well, smile. Well, no, actually, I had one ground down the other day because I chipped it. Uh -uh. Oh dear. I know. The dentist had to grind it down for me the other day. I gotta go see the dentist today in two hours. Yay. Ooh. Oh, they're not gonna be closed down, right? Oh wait, no, they closed down in two days, right? Yeah. Good thing I'm having my dentist appointment now then because I wouldn't be able to get it done after this. How are they gonna do that with the lockdowns? They can't do dentist work with lockdowns. No, don't, don't shut down again. Surprised they didn't want me to take a test before going in there. I mean, I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm not sick at all, but. And I, I don't see a lot of people either. I have very little contact with anybody because I'm always isolated in my truck, right? But, okay, well, she's uh, out of work in two days. Makes me so sad, I love my job! All right, who are we missing? Who are we missing? Wiener, let's go outside, man, come on. Let's go outside. You don't even need your leash anymore, come on. Come on, let me go outside. Are you ready? Careful, whoa, 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 back up, back up. You always forget that the door opens this way. There you go. Hey, there you go, Chevy, Diesel, come on. Whew, still a little bit nipply out here. Just quickly letting the boys out before I go to my dentist appointment. I am really glad that I got this in now because apparently we're locking down for four weeks. I was just talking to my mom. Apparently this is gonna be a four week lockdown now that I, I don't know if that's like official but that's crazy four weeks so i'm glad i'm getting this done now what's going on guys Let's hurry up i got an appointment come on chef Well, here we are. Guess I don't need those. They're just getting fogged up by this muzzle. Time to go inside and get my chompers looked at. I'll talk to you after. And then we're gonna go and uh, check on our trailer on our land outside of town. They might not let me in, I don't know. They asked uh, if I'd been traveling. I'm like, well, I'm a truck driver. So yeah, I have been traveling and they put me on hold. So I don't know. I'm an essential worker. I'm supposed to uh, be able to still come in and get my stuff done, but it's all up to them, right? It's all their individual choice. We'll see if they let me in for my appointment. Just waiting on the phone here. What a mess. What a mess this all is, eh? Well, they took us in. How do they look? Well, they even look better. Oh. Wow, not bad, not bad. All right, Ugh. let's go get the dogs and head out to the property. Nope, 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 wait, 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 wait. We're doing a U-turn first, U-turn. Forgot I have a haircut appointment in 20 minutes. I gotta get my hair cut before these lockdowns come in. <laughs> Otherwise I'm gonna have really messy, really long hair for the next month. Walmart. Where else would I go for a haircut? Timmy. Timmy. You know, through all of this mess and all of this chaos, at least we still got Timmy's. So what do you think? Does it pass the YouTube Certification? Is it a certified good haircut? I feel better. So they are uh, closing down. They, uh, I'm lucky to have gotten an appointment today because they're completely booked up to the end of tomorrow now uh, because everybody's trying to get in and get their hair trimmed or hair cut before the lockdown. Because so they're closing down and they didn't know how long they're gonna be closing down for. Uh, I heard it's gonna be four weeks. It, 
who knows? I don't think they've said it on the radio yet. I've been listening. But maybe I gotta go online and find out later tonight. Either way, uh, <laughs> at least we have each other, right? We have each other. I just thought of this. Before going into like critical red lockdown, are they gonna close Tim's? Oh no. I don't think so, I don't think. Tim's is essential. Tim's is essential. Could I get a, uh, a large coffee with two cream and a shot of espresso, please? Sorry, we're actually not able to do espresso right now. Our machine is down. Oh, no. Then just uh, one cream, please. Just one cream? Okay. Yeah. Anything else for you? Mm, that's it. Okay, that'd be 2.15 at the window. Super duper. One day I will find you, awesome possum. I will find you. I will keep looking. If a weird guy in a black truck ever comes through your drive through and after he you're done giving him the price and saying that it'll be ready at the window, if he says super duper, you got to say awesome possum, all right? It's a rule, I think. You know, I've got these Tim cards at home that... Uh, some of you wonderful people out in New Brunswick had left for me there. And <laughs> I left them at home. Ah, I'll use them, don't worry. As long as they don't close Tim's, those Tim cards will be used. You can, you can count on it, I promise. Ready, 215. Run, Babbitt. Okay. Have a good one. Thank you very much. Yeah, no problem. Timmy's, Timmy's. Come on. All right, let's go pick up the boys. Let's go check out the property. And we gotta come home, gotta bring my parents some papers. Uh, my mom for tax papers. And then uh, gotta come back home. Britt wants to do some grocery shopping later today. So, oh, we got lots of fun lined up. I always gotta like, eh. I'm gonna have to get a string on that soon. <laughs> Barely reach it. Nice to have a gate though. Uh, so it's also our laundry room. The mud room, the, the lobby, the, the the everything. It's an everything room. Let's leave it there. Hey, guess who's back? I'm back, yeah. Hey, hey, everybody. Hey, hey. Come on. Come on. Oh, I can't get it out. All right. Don't step on the little guys. Just got to be careful, man. All right, let's take everybody outside real quick. And then you big guys are coming with me. All right. Sorry, little guys. The big guys need to run a little bit more than you. All right, everybody. Come on. Come on. Everybody out. Everybody out. Everybody out. I think I'm gonna have to gear up a little bit more. It's getting cold fast. I need a little bit more than this thin little fall sweater. Going up to the bush requires the right attire. There we go. My dad fixed our uh, old riding mower. Did I tell you already? Fixed our old riding mower so uh, I can come in here and mow things down a little more with that thing. Cause I don't want to use our new zero point turn in this in this yard yet. Not until we get it all developed. 
Alrighty, boys. You ready for this? Come on out. Let's go and check everything. <laughs> Alright, so... Everything looks good. Now, let's just do a little perimeter check of it. Everything's looking good, as it should. Go and check the inside in a minute here. All right, let's check her out. Oh, it's pretty dark in here. I don't think the lights will work. Batteries have been disconnected yet. Everything is as it should be. It's good, it's good. All of these are bounce sheets. They keep critters out or they're supposed to help. And so far, ever since we've done this for winter, haven't had any problems. We had one mouse get in last, uh, last winter, but he got into my little present for him and he died. And that's my story. That's good. Lock her back up again. This whole area in here is getting cleared down. I'm taking a skid steer to it in spring. As soon as it warms up enough and the, the frost leaves us for another year, I'm gonna come in here and push this all down. Come here. Come here. Come on. This jacket was very expensive from Cabela's. How good does it work? Can you see me? Am I invisible? Diesel. Diesel. Chevy, stop eating that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Come on, keep going. Get him. Get him. Get him. Up you go. Diesel, come here, man. Good boys. Well, other than me chasing you guys away for eating deer poop, I think it went pretty good. I don't know what it is with my boys, but man. Straight for the deer poop. Man. It's like some kind of sick delicacy for them or something. I don't know. I'm not a dog. Ugh. Ugh. Well, let's go home. We got lots to do tonight yet. Well, glad everything was as it should be. What's the time now? 10 after 5? Man, it's only 
only 510? Where'd the sun go? Well, I gotta go back home. Britt gets off work at 6, apparently. I thought she got off work at 7.30, but she's getting off early today. She wants to go grocery shopping. Oh, fun times ahead. Fun times ahead, indeed. I gotta go drop these guys off at home first. Can't take you grocery shopping. <laughs> you fill the cart all full of pedigree and dog treats and stuff like that. How was it, boys? Do you guys have fun? We gotta say goodnight and goodbye to everybody, even though it's the next day already. <laughs> Just putting this together for you, and I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. I had a lot of fun making it and a lot of fun putting it together. It's gonna be a fun week. And I'm excited about it. I'm hoping that you guys are gonna be here with me. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because we've been making daily videos for a very long time already. We're on number, what is this? Is this 2128? Let me double check this. 2,128 videos. We make these pretty much every day. Yeah, we're on 2128. Wow, okay. So join the club. We're at almost 105,000 already. Lots of room for you as well. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm gonna do some live streams this week as well. I've ordered some equipment for that uh, uh, American Truck Simulator. To I, I got a new webcam coming that's got a nice little ring light attached to it so you can see my face better, much better than the camera that's on the screen there. Uh, that steering wheel, pedals, and uh, also a nice little headset so you guys can hear me well while I'm talking to you. And we're gonna do some fun live streams. I hope you guys like it because I'm really excited about it. So take care, and we'll see you in tomorrow's video.